sense. Just because Marl is a heavy grab character and Bayonetta, she kind of loses the grab, so. But we'll see how Shadow plays. Shy dude, in this matchup, what Lucina really wants to do is just face around what Mario can do. It's just because Lucina, or Mario just has a really hard time getting in on characters with range, and Lucina is just, Lucina has just so many, ra so much range on our aerials and moves that it just get, makes, makes it really difficult for Mario to get in. But Soul not really having too, too much of a hard time doing that. Back air. Oh, catching the tech roll in. And it's gonna kill. Shy dude, the DI might have been off. It kind of looked like it, but. Uh. <laughs> all right, but sh uh, Shy dude, kind of just taking all these hits. He's just having a really difficult time getting in, which is kind of ironic, just because technically based off the matchup should be the other way around, but we'll see. Oh, interrupting that smash. And not gonna be it. Ooh, the aggressive landing. Uh, Shy Dude was not prepared for that. Yeah, he's trying to catch Shy Dude's air dodge. Like drifting towards stage without smash. Which honest honestly <laughs> Being a stock oh that's gonna take it. Yeah, being a stock up, you can kinda just throw these options out. It's not really unsafe. So don't blame him. Uh, I think Shy Dude, Shy Dude, I don't think he's going to say Lucina, that was, he just looked really uncomfortable and kind of just looked oppressed in that match. Either Bayonetta or Cloud, I can see him go. Maybe Kirby. Because Kirby, Robin, okay. Um, I really don't agree with this. This matchup is just super bad for Robin. Just because Mar Mario has cape to reflect pretty much anything Robin wants to do. And once Mario gets in on Robin, Robin really can't do anything. But we'll see how Shadow plays it out. You never really know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, getting a little bit of a platform extension. And crossing uh, Shadow up there, but Shy er, Soul's just really not getting anything. Back air. Okay, nice perfect shield from Shy Dude. Shy Dude keeping it kind of even, which I would not expect. But yeah, I agree. But down tilt up air. No, Shy Dude with the aggressive landing, recognizing Soul probably going for something, some type of read. So knowing he won't uh, pull the trigger, basically. But 10, 10 to 20 more percent, or kind of, maybe even now, sh uh, Soul is like in checkmate percent. So if I was Soul, I'd be playing really evasive, not really extend too much, and just play super safe versus Robin. Because you really don't want to let her get that grab, because he's definitely in percent. And nice cross up. Nice spacing on the back air. Ooh, that could have been up smash from, Sli or from Soul. But. Ooh, and uh, Shy Dude recognizing the cross up and getting the grab, and he's a checkmate. And now, uh, Soul just really needs to find a way to take the stock. Because if you let Robin get the lead, and there you go. But if you let Robin get the lead, you can kind of. It just gets scary because Robin has rage and slowly builds his percent, and then suddenly you're already in checkmate percent again. But Soul finding it. Jab, jab, forward tilt. Okay, taking his jump. This might be big. No. Try to do if we get out. <laughs> Reflecting the arc fire. Down tilt, yeah. Yeah, both of them not really wanting to commit too hard. Because at this percent, if you commit, that might be it. 
No, good DI, but at 50%, if you overextend a little too much, that it'll just be the end of the stock. And you just really don't want to let your opponent just get in like that. But spot dodging through the under. That might be a Yeah, checkmate's going to kill. The Robin pick actually working out. That's Out of all the characters you would have picked or pulled out, the Robin would be like, in my opinion, the worst character he could he could have picked, um, matchup wise, right? Right? Yeah. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I mean, I I agree. I think. I don't know. I agree though. So we got uh, the shy or the shy dude Bayonetta and the Diddy Kong coming out from Soul. It's what you when it comes to these two players, what you pretty much expect. Um, both they kind of go back and forth. I think Soul might have the um, yeah. I, I was about to say I think Soul has the advantage in terms of. The amount of set wins, but Shaidu does definitely take its sets off. But we will have to see. This matchup is pretty. A lot of people would say this matchup goes in Diddy Kong's favor, but it, it really depends on how the Bayo plays and how good the Bayo is when it comes to spacing versus Diddy and item play and all these things. It really just takes into account in this matchup. We see it time and time again. Uh, when it comes to uh, top players, especially when Zero was in, was still playing, you'd, it'd be a, you'd see it a lot. But yeah, Battlefield. I, I thought Shadow was gonna get the wall bounce with the uh, side B, but it just looked like he just slid right under Battlefield. Not getting it. But it's gonna be it. No, good SDI from him. So I'm not getting up there. Go Nair, interesting. Fair. Yeah, just kind of. Oh, really bad monkey flip. Soul just really throwing out these. It might seem kind of, kind of weird, but these very safe and very hard to punish um, pressure, like sharking on the ledge, on the platforms. Trip on the banana. Yeah, it's looking really bad for Shady now. It's just in this matchup. Or I guess versus Diddy in general, it's it's one of those things where if you just kind of let Diddy, Diddy do things, it's just really hard to get out. That's what you know the Diddy vortex, as everyone uh, says. But let's see if, if Shadow can bring it. Air dodge. Ooh, throwing up the witch time, like a delayed witch time. Cause Psycho, was, or my bad, Soul was definitely looking for like up throw into air dodge, up throw, up air, or like up smash. I don't know what's happening. Up trash. No, he's out of it. Let's see. Which time? Okay. Up smash, yeah. So definitely not out of the realm of possibility for Shady to take. Bayonetta is known for just taking stocks whenever she really feels like it. It's probably especially against a character like Diddy Kong where it's super easy to edge guard. If you catch a monkey flip like over the stage, you can just get a witch time or a witch twist combo. But oh, <laughs> the run up barrel is taking it, and set going to shine or soul. 